What's going on guys, it's Dan here, welcome to the Game Unboxing. Today is Monday, March 18th. It's a very unusual day for an unboxing. Um, but yeah, these guys decided to release this game on the Monday, and it is a Nintendo game on, well, I don't even know if you would, yeah, I guess it would be a Nintendo game. But anyway, the, probably the, um, actually yeah, this is only the second Wii U exclusive game, or Wii U game that I've actually played since Super Mario Bros. U. New Super Mario Bros. U. That is Lego City Undercover. This game was supposed to be a Wii U launch title, but they delayed it. I don't, I don't know why. I'm glad they did, because that would have been just a gong show if they put it all out on the same day. But anyways, um, I don't know if this is going to be like a system seller or not, but I can tell you right now that I'm definitely going to do it, and I, I can't wait for it, because people love it when I do my Lego gameplays. Like, always. It seems to be always the case. Whenever I post a Lego game, everyone's watching it, everyone's loving it. So... Hopefully the gamepad makes the experience a little better. I mean, it's pretty much a giant useless brick at this point, but nonetheless, it is there. Now, before we get into, you know what, we'll look at this first. We'll look at this first. So we got Lego City Undercover. On the inside, you've got your game disc, Wii U game disc, and as well as, okay, you have your, just a minute, you have your instruction book. I'm assuming colored. These guys have always been, like, good for colored Nintendo. Yep. Nice big detail color instruction booklet telling you to buy Lego City game sets and the French version. So it's nothing crazy, probably because the controls aren't all that um, unbelievable, but anyway, here's what Nintendo puts this in all their games. If you liked it, oh sorry, that's French. Uh, where's the English version? Oh, it's on the top. Sorry, I missed that. <laughs> Stupid ass. If you like Lego City Undercover, check out these other great games. You got Sing Party, Super Mario Bros. U, and Nintendo Land. I have these two games. Never played Nintendo Land because it looked like crap. So I didn't even bother. But yeah. So anyway, we have that. On the inside, you have this stuff. What is on the inside? Oh. It's more too detailed version of that crap. Look at this dumb broad. Look at this. Look at her singing to her Wii U gamepad on the left there. Who's going to do that? I certainly won't. <laughs> and this form right here, I'm not going to show you because it's got a pin. Actually, I can cover it up. No big deal. This is basically just to register the game with Club Nintendo. That's it. That's it. And they, each Wii game has something like this. So, i got to remember to do that, get points for it, so on and so forth. Okay? So, aside from that, we can look at the back of this thing to... It kind of looks like he's holding the Wii U gamepad himself, doesn't it? Look. Doesn't it? That guy right there. Anyway, he's got his many disguises. Go undercover as Officer Chase McCain. Using the Wii U gamepad controller, your ultimate detective tool. Le Legos. Huh? Never mind. Anyway, uh, I don't know if this is a co-op game. Of course it's a Telltale game. Not Telltale. Traveler's Tales. They make all the Lego games, except this is the first Wii U exclusive. So, I'm going to put that over here for now. And, oopsie, and show you guys. Yes, I get a little Chase, what's his name again? Chase McBain or Chase McQueen or something like that? Chase McCain. Yeah, so I get a little Chase McCain figurine. I'm going to open it up and show him. And watch, as soon as, as soon as I open this, I don't even have to. As soon as people saw this, like, can I have it? Like, people? It's pretty ridiculous. Can I have it? You guys sound like... Do you know what you sound like when you say that? You sound like a fly girl. Are you a fly girl? Can I have that? That'd be awesome. Mail it to England for me. Even though it's a tiny little, little Lego figurine worth two cents. Um, mail it anyway. I want it. Really. Anyway, uh... Just a second. Just gotta get his hair on. There. I don't think he's... Yeah, maybe he is. Alright, here's my little Lego. Chase McCain. If it'll focus. Yo, this guy here. Hello. Maybe that'll help. Hello, I'm right here. His face is here. I see you in there. 
I know you're there. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyway, I don't think it's going to focus. It's just too small of an object. But anyways, you get the point. It's a little, little Lego figurine. Oops, I think I put it on backwards. I did. What a dumbass. Sorry. I put the head. Head can be spun around. That was stupid of me. Crap. That was his hair. Dropped his hair. His hair can be rearranged as well. And the body. I just gotta spin the torso. There. That's better. See, I, had, I thought I saw police, so I just thought that was the front of his vest, but now it makes sense that the badge is on the front, am I right? There. Uh, that's somewhat better. There you go. Now it's focusing on him. So, yeah, there you go. Pretty random. Don't really care. Can I have it? No, you cannot. I'm not gonna mail that to like England or Zimbabwe or something. You know how expensive that would be just to mail this little piece of thing? I don't know, I got that last time. Every time I have something and I show it, everyone was always like, can I have that? Give it to me. And then I say, like, they don't even say please or anything. They're like, give it to me. That's mine. Give it. <laughs> sure, that's gonna help your cause. Anyway. That's it for the unboxing for LEGO City Undercover. I can't wait to try this game out. It is a free roaming game from what I understand. They said it's GTA style even, so, except you're a leg, you're all LEGO and you're a cop instead, so. Hopefully it's a good one. So stay tuned guys for the gameplay. That's gonna be coming up right away here. But until then, thanks again for watching and we'll see you in game.